What does low latency mean to you? What does low latency mean to me? And even then, when we actually even finally agree that we're talking about the same thing, um, interpretations of what low latency goals are can be completely different and very, very wide spectrum. So we're going to try to get some goals and guidelines around some of this as well. Um, latency can be seen as things like time to video play. So that's more like startup time. But that impacts also what is often viewed as live latency. So how close am I to real time, right? You know, hand wave test. I wave my hand on the camera, and you're watching it on your device. How many seconds later do you see that hand wave, right? Um, they are related, because if you take longer to start, you're going to most likely have longer also latency in your live. But that isn't completely the whole picture. When we look at normal streaming today, which in my book is um, HTTP based, so HLS primarily. Let's say Dash throw it in there too, because I wish Dash was, was even more prevalent than it is. But HLS being the primary one that we work with all the time, um, normal delivery, normal latency is 30 to 45 seconds plus. Right? That's, that's if you're doing a pretty good job, you're going to see around that type of latency. Um, reduced latency is anywhere from 18 to 5 seconds. Um, and that's where a lot of people wish they were, uh, but aren't oftentimes. Low latency, um, really, we, we count that as anything less than 10 seconds. Um, five seconds is the typical latency for cable, um, HD cable. So we're talking action on the field to seeing it on your TV screen, not going through the internet, is actually about a five second latency from, from lens to screen. Um, and then, you know, so anything at that or below is considered close enough to real time. Um, if you're beating the TV, then you're doing something really right. Um, and you're probably doing it very dangerously. <laughs> uh, low latency is you know, anywhere from the, some people consider it less than 10, down to two to three seconds. And then real time, um, you know, anything less than often, well, real time normally is considered less than one second. Um, but there's even terms and, and different standards that count that differently. Uh, ultimately, what I'm trying to say is there's no real set information, but there's the kind of bucket guidelines, right? Where we're at today, and we want to get better. And how are we going to kind of start to achieve that?